Hey, hello everybody, what is going on? It is Gage, and today I have a new tutorial out for you guys. Um, so someone messaged me uh, while I was gone um, over the weekend, and they asked, or well, they said, hey, I just got a Mac computer. I noticed with iMovie, I can actually do movie trailers. Can you make a tutorial on how to make a uh, good movie trailer? So I'm going to go ahead and do that today. Uh, sorry about my voice. Um, I kind of lost my voice over the weekend. So if it's a little off or dull or whatever, uh, I apologize. Uh, but anyway, let's just go ahead and hop into this tutorial. So what you're going to want to do first is you're going to want to go up here uh, to File. And you're going to want to go to New Project. Or you can just push Command N um, on your keyboard. I'll just go ahead and click it. Um, it should then bring up this little box here. And in this little box, um, there is some different things that you can do. First, we're going to want to name our project. So I'm going to go ahead and name this just uh, um, iMovie Trailer Tutorial. Uh, that'll work. Um, and then next, you have the aspect ratio and the frame rate. Don't worry about those. Just keep them how they are. Um, next thing is we're going to want to pick our type of movie trailer. So there's different genres. So just scroll down here and you will see all the different genres. Uh, they have them underneath each trailer. So you have like action, adventure, blockbuster. Um, you got a holiday, love story, romantic comedy, sports, travel, supernatural, spy. Uh, and there's some other ones. So what you're going to want to do is pick the um, type of genre that your video or movie is. Uh, I'm going to actually go ahead and do action. Um, so yeah, I'm going to click action and what you're going to want to do is then push create and this is going to bring up the outline storyboard and shot list. So the first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go through our outline and change all these to what fits our video. So first things first is our movie name. I'm going to name, uh, mine longboarding, uh, Longboarding, let's do longboarding weekend. Uh, I'm just going to be using footage that we filmed this weekend for my friends. A longboarding video. Uh, so I'll just name it that. Then what you're going to want to do is the release year. Um, I'm going to do summer of 2013. Uh, you really don't have to necessarily follow, ex follow exactly what it says on the side. You can kind of uh, put whatever you want there. So next thing is release season. I already said summer, so... Actually, if it's going to say that, I'll just keep it as 2013. Uh, then there's cast members. Now, um, the different type of genres may have um, a different outline. You just kind of follow what it has. So I'll just do uh, my friends that were with me uh, this weekend. I'll do Eli and Yvonne. Um, and then what you're going to do is your studio name. I'll just keep longboarding bros. Pick your logo style. There's like a regular black background. You got suns. You got the sun through the clouds. Um, you, you just pick the one that you want. Then the credits. Um, I already. I'll just keep this how it is. Uh, but you can go through your credits and fill out all that information for your video, like who it's directed by, who edited it, um, <coughs> the costume designer if you have one, the music that's in your video, uh, your video or movie. Also, uh, so. Now, let's go ahead and jump on over to this storyboard. This is where you're going to actually insert your uh, footage. So, what you can do, um, or what you're going to want to do, is kind of follow the outline it gives you. So, notice this one. It says that it, it should be an action shot. Um, and then this one says it should be Eli. This one says it should be Vaughn. You got another action shot a landscape, two shots, things like that. So just kind of follow what it says and find the clip that kind of fits that. Now you don't necessarily have to follow this, but uh, to get the best looking trailer, usually following this will work out to your benefit. <coughs> so I'm going to go ahead and just kind of um, hurry this part up here. I'm just going to kind of throw in um, the footage that kind of fits this. Now it may not be the best footage, but I'm just going to kind of hurry through this part Okay, so now we have gotten all of our footage in there. 
So now that the footage is in there, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go back and change uh, <coughs> the text that is in um, in between each clip because the text probably isn't going to fit our video. So what we can do is go to the storyboard here and we'll keep the intros longboarding bros. <coughs> Excuse me. Next it says Eli lives in the fast lane. So I'm just going to change this to Eli and then we'll scroll down to the next one. I'll say once Eli and Yvonne once it all um and then I'll say but who will get it so that's 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 kind of cheesy uh but just for the sake of time, I'm just going to use that. So anyway, let's go ahead and preview what we've done. Uh, this doesn't really take long to do uh, because you're really just following an outline and it's actually pretty easy to do. But uh, let's go ahead and check out what we have. So hopefully um, that uh, kind of gives you uh, the basic idea on how to make your own trailer uh, right here in iMovie. It's really not that hard. All you're doing is following the outline. And if you get um, those, those shots correctly like it says to, you should end up with a pretty uh, good trailer um, because uh, w using iMovie here. Uh, all you really got to do, like I said, is just follow the outline and automatically puts music in there. Um, it gives you the outline for the for the credits at the end, and it gives you the outline for where text should go. So it really is a helpful tool. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope it was helpful. And if you have any other tutorials you would like me to do, uh, just hit me up here on my second channel, and I'd be glad to make you a tutorial. Thanks for watching. Peace.